Hey guys, I stopped at the Dollar Tree on the way home. I have a bag full of Dollar Tree makeup. I see everybody doing it online and everybody's like, oh, Dollar Tree makeup is the same, Dollar Tree makeup is the same. Let's put it to the test. Start with LA Colors Waterline and Elf Liner in black. We'll throw this on. I'm pretty picky about my Waterline Liner because it really should go on nice and smooth. This went on, but I wouldn't characterize it as smooth as some of the other stuff I use, but it's getting on there. All right, I'm actually gonna try this as well in the middle of the lashes here. I'm gonna go right across my bottom waterline. This one is definitely better than the LA Colors one. It actually gives you a nice line. So I'm gonna work a little bit with this. Okay, I have this LA Colors, which is really similar to what I wear every day. And I also got this kind of glitter pot, which I'm gonna use as an illuminizer, as well as something on the eyelid. So let's see how these work out. Wow, it's actually not bad. I on, I'm gonna be honest with you. I really thought I'd be calling bullshit by now when people say it's decent product. This isn't bad. I'm actually shocked. Remember guys, I'm not a makeup artist. Makeup artists everywhere are going, oh my God. I know something bad is happening and I don't know what. It's me. You guys, this water lily palette is actually a good palette. I'm a little bit, um, I'm a little bit surprised here because this stuff is not bad. I literally thought this was just gonna be a video where I'm telling you Everybody says it's so great and it's not. LA Colors is actually a decent line. I'm actually kind of surprised here, if we're being honest. Okay, got some bronzer. I'm actually gonna use a bronzer and a bronzing stick. Both are LA Colors. This one's in Sun Goddess, the shoe fits. And then this one is in some kind of brown. And so I'm gonna throw these on right now and warm up the face a little bit. Sorry, this video is so long. But just go through it and fast forward to the parts that you actually want to see, if you want to see any. But this is doing a really nice job. This color is actually really nice. <laughs> it reminds me of the Hula color for sure. and does a really nice job like warming up the face. And now I'm going to take this pencil, go down the sides of the nose. Give it some This stick is a little yellowy for me, but we can make it work because it actually is blendy. Guys, I'm really surprised here. We've got some nice warmth going on, some great colors. All right, let's see. I'm going to take this little pot, which came with the eyeshadow shimmer. And I'm going to give myself a little shimmering here and there, like up here. This is a bad brush. That's a bad brush. Gives it a nice little sparkle. Beep. Okay, we get two LA Colors colors. So there's one dark and one light. This one's actually a little too dark and this one's actually a little bit too light. So I'm actually gonna ombre them a little bit and then I'll throw some of that sparkle on top. Okay, I'm gonna start with the lighter color and start coming down on it. And then we'll go to the darker color. It's actually Pretty. You guys, this is surprisingly pretty. Surprisingly. And then when I tell you, like, I was coming on here, I thought this was going to be like a comedy show of me basically like calling BS on all this product, but it's actually not bad. And it's coming out kind of pretty. Okay, they did not have any lip liner at the dollar store. So I did use my makeup by Mario. Give me a break, ease me in a little bit here. So, but, and they had a very limited selection of lipsticks. So I did end up with this e.l.f. lipstick in Classy. It was the lightest lipstick I could find, but in my color scheme. And then this lip gloss in Dreamy Pink from LA Colors. So we'll see, they're actually pretty colors. So let's see what happens. Okay, we'll actually goes on not bad. I think if I didn't have lip liner on, it would slip a bit. But it's actually not bad. And actually, it's a really pretty color. I like it, especially with the 
eyeshadow, which looks really nice with it. I'm gonna break my dollar, my dollar eyeshadow, dollar twenty-five. Get it now, cause this year it's next year it's gonna be a dollar fifty. That's really pretty. Stop. Okay, I'm a little bit surprised. Finally, got some LA Colors mascara. I got the lengthening because I like those starry eyes, and I figured we'd have a little bit of fun today and throw some extensions on the end, which I normally don't do, but I thought I would need the extra help, and we're gonna do that a little bit today. So let's see how fancy we can go. The fake lashes are a fail. Not because of the lashes. I think that was big time user error, and that just wasn't gonna work out for me. Oh, this is actually pretty good. This is my good eye though. I think everybody has like a good eye and a bad eye of lashes. My lashes on my other eye sometimes get a little bit wonky. So I can really tell whether or not the mascara is good if I always start with this eye. This is actually decent. I'm gonna put another coat on. I'm gonna do my wonky eye and I'll be back. I don't love this brush. I usually love brushes that don't go in and out like that. This has like one of those in and out brushes. And I don't usually love that. It's also really hard to wipe off if you made make a mistake. So I'm gonna to have to hit that with eye makeup remover. I'm gonna throw a little bit more of an eye line on and then it will be done. Okay guys, not bad. Actually really pretty colors and really pretty texture. So let's do the run through of what is a bye or a bye bye. The eyeliners, I would say no. These are gonna have to find another home somewhere. The bronzer, total win. I'm actually keeping that for sure. Also keeping the bronzer, the bronze contour stick. This was really nice. Even though I thought it was a little bit warm, it actually looks really nice. These blushers, blushes made a gorgeous combination. I really love that ombre look, so those are great. This lipstick was super cute. I don't know if I would pick it every day, and this lip gloss was actually really nice. The mascara is a no for me, for sure. Did I already say something about this eyeshadow? This eyeshadow is really good. This, I like seriously good. I'm actually keeping this and I'm popping it right on the top of my um, vanity here. The lashes, I just can't do lashes, honestly. I'm a loser when it comes to lashes. I can't do it. Um, and this was surprisingly so good. I would toss the brush and use my own brushes, but this little pot of illumination is adorable and I think it's so multifunctional I actually should have put it here as well uh, and just given myself a little bit of shimmer here and there but th this is adorable and they had it in cute little colors like white and pink and things like that so anyway I'm sorry for the long video um, hopefully you guys didn't bore yourselves and fa fast forwarded through the parts that you didn't like but there you go the one time only show limited edition makeup from the Dollar Tree face all right <laughs> Hope you guys liked it. I'm actually surprised. I really thought I'd be like tossing stuff over my shoulder and trying to figure out where to throw stuff quickly enough. So there you go. Have a good day, everyone.